Hey guys, I wasn't planning on coming on, but I decided to um, turn the camera on because I'm doing a deep conditioning treatment. Um, today's the day before Labor Day, the Sunday, and I just did my routine wash and conditioning of my hair. And I was wondering what to use for a deep conditioner. Last week I did a henna treatment, so, you know, I did my thing last week, but I saw a video of... African Exports, Venetia, and she was doing a review of the Elasta QP DPR11, the Deep Penetrating Conditioner. Now, as you can see, it's almost done for me. I've had this for over a year or so. I loved this in its original formula. Loved it, loved it, but then they changed it up, and um, the previous uh, packaging was like a white packaging with black, um, black and white, and I really loved that. But but for some reason, I tried this one. I got it at my beauty surprise store, and I never, I, I didn't quite like it. It's supposed to be a vitamin-rich organic infusion um, with olive oil. It's new and improved, but I wasn't too crazy about it. But after seeing Venetia's um, video, I decided to just use it again, just to see what it is, if I actually like it or not. She gave it rave reviews, but... Who knows, maybe I didn't pay attention when I did it with um, maybe a protein treatment or, you know, something like that. Not sure. Um, it doesn't have proteins, but I'm just curious to see how, you know, it works this time around. Because, darn it, I want to finish this bottle up. If I knew somebody to give it to, I would have given, to it, given it away already. So, I'm going to use heat with it. I'm going to use my... Um, my new uh, heating cap, which I don't mind. It's pretty good. I'm going to do a review on it. The consistency of this is very creamy. So you, it, it goes on really well. It has a lot of slip and it really has a nice smell. Okay. And I like stuff with slip because it just makes the application so much easier. I'm just checking if it has cones in it. Um, it has water and all kinds of stuff. It has a lot of oils and vitamins in there. I might, yeah, it does have the methicone in it, so there you go. Anyway, I'm going to put it on, but it really weighs the hair down. And what I, I recall not liking about it, I just didn't think it left my hair feeling moisturized enough. So, I don't know. I'm going to see what happens. Um, hopefully, I'll like how it feels. And I'm going to try and use everything up. Um, it's very slick. So, um, maybe it's the cone that gives it that silky, shiny look. So, I'm going to just finish it off. And then I'm going to put the heat cap on and hope that it feels better than it did in my previous usage of this jar. Okay, and also it is was $5.99 on special. It's probably about $7.99 regularly. So it's a good value for your money. And the thing about things sometimes change because when you do products and line change their um ingredient doesn't necessarily work as the original did. So with that being said, I I'm gonna give my review, my thoughts on this uh thing. I want to verbally thank you guys too for the input in my beauty supply store discussion. I really enjoyed reading all the comments. Sorry I couldn't get back to, to each and each one, but there, it was such an overwhelmingly positive response to that video. And I really um, liked reading, you know, everyone's experiences and so on. So thank you all so much for participating. Um, you know, I think I might need to do more discussion type things. I, I 
deliberately try to stay away from those kinds of stuff but when it's pertinent to me I think it's a great forum for us to discuss things and talk because it's not all about hair and and everyday just hair stuff life is deeper than that so um, if you guys have any thoughts as to what you'd want to discuss let me know um, yeah so I've put it in and I'm going to put my cap on, go under the heat for probably 15 minutes and I'll come back. Okay? Hey guys, so I just plugged out my heat cap. So I'm going to take it off for you guys. This thing is really, really so much better than the other one, guys. It gives some good heat. So we're going to take a look at the hair and I had it on for more than 20 minutes might have been for about um, 25 minutes but my hair really feels nice and warm so I'm gonna go in let me take one down just to show you guys it really weighs the hair down I mean, it's really a heavy, creamy DC. So I'm going to wash this out and come back. It feels soft and slippery. So yeah, I'm going to wash it out, guys, and come back and show you immediately how it looks when I step, step out of the shower. Hey, guys, so I've just stepped out of the shower, and my hair doesn't feel too bad. Um... Upon rinsing it out, I kind of felt like a film. There's some things that when I wash them out of my hair under the shower and it gets in my face, it kind of leaves a film on my lips. Um, I don't know what it is, if it's a particular, I've never paid attention to see what it might have been. If it's maybe some ingredient in there that makes that film seem to come over my, like I can taste it. Even with the Oyen handmade honey wash. That kind of leaves a film on my mouth, which I don't like. But anyway, I kind of slightly got some of that. But the hair feels good. It feels nice. Um, but I did feel that filmy feeling. And it feels soft, moisturized. It feels all right, y'all. Um, I'm going to come back and show you guys. Let me show you my hair close up. Okay. So, it's not too bad, but I'm going to come back and give you guys a rundown on, on it. Alright? See ya. Hey guys, so I'm just coming on to wrap up this review on this, um, thing. Now... I kind of liked it this time around, but considering that I used all of this prior um, and wasn't quite happy, I'm not sure uh, either. Like, I, But I did like it this time around. But apparently the difference I... The difference in my application this time around was that I administered some heat to it. So that might have made a difference. Um... I said my hair feels soft. It does, but it actually feels kind of noisy too. I don't know why. And that is the feeling that I had before. It's as if there is a film over my hair. Almost like the, what I got with the Shea Moisture, um, Shea Moisture, whatever it is, hair mask. That same kind of feeling. So, I would not purchase this again. I loved the old formula. I don't know what's with these people when they decide to change. I mean, we all know that these aren't natural ingredients, but they try to reconfigure their marketing strategy and target it to a more organic um, infusion, vitamin-rich, olive oil. But it ain't no same. Just accept the fact that it's not 
it's not natural and stop trying to pull stunts with consumers and try to make it seem as if, as if it's new I like the old formula I don't know what they did they enriched it with olive oil and I don't like it okay so in saying so I'm not saying guys don't try try everybody has a different reaction to, to products so I wouldn't say don't use it but I didn't like it for my hair okay um, in contrast to prior, when it was the old version, I used to get my hair really moisturized and really happy with it. And it was actually somewhat of a staple. And that was at the beginning of my journey. Actually, not even beginning, even in relaxed days. So, it's fine at nine. It's worth trying. I mean, you're getting 15 ounces for that. So, Venetia loved it. African Expert loved it. And... You know, I wish I could love it, but it's it's not giving me what I want from it. Like, I know I get real satisfaction when I use my organics hair mayonnaise, but this, this has been sitting here for over a year, and I just decided to use it up. So, um, check out African Exports review on this, and hopefully... That will give you a balance as to, you know, what you want to hear or find out about it. Um, but for now, it's okay, not great. And I'm just going to style my hair for the week because although tomorrow is a holiday, I have school. School starts this week. So, yeah, too bad about this. I really like the old formula and it annoys me when they change these formulas and you know it comes up with something less satisfactory I've already had a natural product nothing has really changed except for the infusions there's still the cone in there that was in there before and it worked well so anyway guys enough rambling it's okay not great but try it for the price you can try it if it doesn't work for you pass it on to somebody else alright guys take care bye